Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can fix an error in Gmail uh, giving you, you an error message. You can't send or receive emails because you are out of storage space. Well, it's not really an error, it's just a notice that telling you that you can't use your account anymore because the account storage is full. So to fix this problem, we're going to need to take a look at what is using up all your storage space. So the first thing that we're going to do is to open up a web page and then we're trying to locate the source uh, of an app or the services that's using up all the uh, account space. So in here in the address bar, we type in one dot gmail or dot google, sorry, dot google.com and then forward slash storage. And here, so we're going to tap on storage and in here we're going to find out what is using up your account. So you can see here the account have 15 gigabyte of space, 6.1 gigabyte is already been used. So the three main services that is using up your Google account is Google Drive, Gmail, and Google Photos. Now, Google Drive is used on your mobile phone to uh, backup data. For example, you can backup your data, uh, photos, and other things to uh, do a drive. In Gmail, you got um, that's for your emails, and you got Google Photos. So let's um, look at Google Drive first. You can see here it's only using up 1.65 gigabytes. So on your phone, you can open up the Google Drive. So you can, if you swipe up, you can go into the app screen and then tap on Google. And here you can tap on Drive. If you do not have Google Drive installed on your phone, you can install it on your phone uh, from Play Store. Otherwise, you can uh, go to the web page and then um, tap on Google Drive here. So if I tap on that and I can visit Drive. So that will basically just open up. Um, so I'm just going to go to Samsung Internet, use that instead. And so you can do it on the web. So you, you can either do it on the web or uh, from an app. So that's totally up to you. So if you go into the app screen, tap on Google Folder, tap on Drive. This will open up the Drive. Now also take notice that you can view the storage space in Google Drive uh, using this method as well. So if you tap on the menu key, then tap on uh, settings, uh, sorry, not settings, uh, tap on storage. In storage, it should bring up a page. So here it is. So I'm going to bring up the page and it will show you what is being used as well. Google Drive, Gmail, and Google Photos. So those are the three services using up the account storage space. So let's go back here into um, photos, or into your, into your drive. And in the Google Drive, you can see it will show you all the files that is being used. So you can sort files um, by, uh, by size. So if I tap on um, my drive, for example, and then tap on storage use at the top here, if you tap on that, and it says sort by at the bottom here, you can choose sort by storage use. So that will reverse uh, from ascending to descending or from descending to ascending. So just tap on storage use at the top here, and then tap on storage use. And now you can see the largest, the largest file size displayed from the top down. So now let's say if you want to delete this file, just tap on the menu key, then go down and then tap on removed. And that file is now moved to the trash folder. So if the file is staying in your trash folder, it's still using up your account storage space. Uh, in a minute, I will show you how you can uh, empty the trash folder as well. So here, continue, go to down, go down the list, and then uh, select any files that you want to remove. So remove any file that's using up all the storage space. And you can see here, a couple of files is over a few hundred megabytes. So just delete them. And then tap on remove. If you really want to keep the file, you can actually download it to your computer or download it to your phone. So I'm just going to delete it because I don't need the file. And that's it. So now we have cleaned up my drive. Continue to do that on your my drive. Delete any files that you want you don't want to keep. Then tap on the mute key. Then tap on trash. And in here, make sure it is removed from trash as well. So delete forever. So just go on here and delete everything forever. I wonder if you can multi-select. So you can multi-select. So tap and hold and then select multiple files. And then tap on the mute key and tap on delete forever. 
and that is now uh, removed from the trash it's gone you now have um, reclaim your storage space from Google Drive so that is one of the way now we're going to go next so I'm going to go back and let's uh, look at the next thing that we can try so I'm just going to go into um, one dot google com and then on storage so in storage here we got gmail and google photos so let's go to google photos and let's see how you can uh, delete them so again we go into the google folder tap on photos in photos you can see it shows all the videos and photos that you have in here so you can browse by photos by albums or uh, for you so just go into photos it will show you everything and then go down the list here and remove any files that you don't want to keep so this one here I can just tap and hold and then select any pictures or videos that you no longer want to keep if anything that you want to keep you can download it to your phone so here I'm just going to tap on the delete button so I say remove from Google account and sync devices so I'm going to tap move to trash so the file is now moved to trash but it's still on your account so still using up your account storage space so we need to totally remove it so we're going to tap on the mute key here then tap on trash and then tap on the mute key and tap on select you can select all of it so I'm just trying to do a multi select and then tap on delete button and say items will be permanently deleted from your Google account so tap on delete and now it's gone so um, the only items delete in Google Photos show here they will be removed after 60 days so instead of waiting for 60 days we are going ahead and delete everything so it's all gone from the trash so we have now at this point successfully reclaim your storage space so you can check in Google Drive we can uh, go in here and then storage and from here you can check to see how much storage space you have left so this is pretty good so we're only using up 2.84 gigabyte out 15 gigabyte available so we have now a lot more space now let's go to Gmail so let's say if um, Gmail is using up all the storage space open up Gmail and in Gmail you can tap on the folders and check all the folders that has all a lot of the emails you can delete all the emails that you don't want to but one of the things that actually causing a lot of um, storage space usage is uh, attachment in emails so in the search for emails so at the top here search mailbox so in the text field you want to put in has attachment and then larger and then column and then the file size so on here I ask what I have done is I've filtered out emails with any emails that has attachment and any uh, email that has attachment larger than 3 megabytes now you can change this number to anything that you like uh, say 1 megabyte you can uh, filter out any emails that is larger than 1 megabyte you can even filter it out to 10 megabyte or 15 or 20 so you can see here this uh, two uh, emails has attachment with um, with an attachment size larger than 10 megabytes so if you have a bunch of them thousand and thousand of them you might want to delete them so once you locate any uh, emails that has uh, a lot of um, usage you can delete it so uh, you can either just tap on it and then delete the emails so you can just delete them from your uh, search result so I'm trying to select uh, the email I uh, hear this so you can select it so tap and hold and then if there's any more you can multi select and then delete them all at once so it is now removed so once it is removed always uh, make sure that you go into your um, go into your trash and then remove everything from trash so in the trash bin just delete everything empty trash now empty and now it's get removed from your device so that's those are the three things that you can do is to delete um, items, delete files from Google Drive, delete them from uh, Google Photos, and delete any emails that has large attachments from Gmail, 
And once you have done that, uh, you might uh, refresh your page or reload the web page. And you may notice the error message still there, stays there at the top. That is because you have only recently deleted um, files from different services and they may not have um, sync um, already. So it may take some time for it to sync the information. So while you can uh, use Gmail immediately, but the information may not sync through. So you have, may have to wait for several hours to maybe one or two days before the error message will actually goes away. And that's it. I hope uh, this helped you out. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.